I guess it helps if you take the cap off, huh? That might help. So, Lynn, do you want to tell, tell, tell everyone where we're going? No. Alright, I'll ask Erica. <laughs> Erica, tell us about this trip. We are going to the Pembina River. Pembina River is in central Alberta. It's tradition for, for young 20-somethings to, to uh, strap floaties to the back of their trucks like Tracy did over there and uh, take these couple kilometers down river and then you hop in it and you float down with a beer in hand and it's, uh, it's good times. We're just waiting to get our convoy going. Casper and Amanda are leading the way. Tim is the uh, driver of this unit here. Oh no no! The narrator must remain uh, <laughs> omnipotent and and omniscient and maybe not omnipotent, mostly just omniscient. Impotent. Impotent. That's clever. You're. That's. Imp <laughs> That's how you know you're doing it right. That's right. In uh, in Edmonton, you don't you don't accelerate. You peel out. Yeah. But like, I guess you have to be on YouTube, right? What's that? I guess you have to be on YouTube, right? And they wouldn't let you upload stuff like that. Uh, yeah, no, they wouldn't let you upload stuff like that. You're probably right. People will try though, don't you think? This is the quaint town of Entwistle. Whistle, Alberta. So, at the end of this road there's a cemetery, and everybody knows that you park your car at the cemetery and march down to Pembina River, you drop your tubes in the water, just float, you just float. I did. Now, okay. <laughs> it's a yellow button. Yeah. Just toss. <laughs> Give it a toss. Does that does it float with the thing? I don't know if it's a float. Don't toss it. Probably just get it. <laughs> High five. Yeah. <laughs> Woo. Eat <laughs> This has to end eventually. I guess so. Did I explode? Yes, you did. Oh! <laughs> yes, <yay! laughs> Flip over that car and you outlaw. Wow, that's good. Yeah, I kept telling you. See, does that mean that we won? Yeah, I, yeah. I, I, I told you. I told you. You are the worst outlaw. Oh, guys, I had to Grant was a liar. Grant was a liar. You're very so worst so outlaw. Good. You were out at the very beginning of the game. You spent the rest of the game giving me shit. What's the matter?
Because it's a it's an iconic Canadian pastime. Well, don't show me. Just show the. Yeah. It's just gonna be a Tamara, this camera. No biggie. You go cross-eyed when you look at that. Okay. Welcome. I will now demonstrate the perfect s'more. First and foremost, very important, these family digestives. If you don't have them at your grocery store, you probably have something similar. Just the graham cracker with the chocolate already applied. Very useful. You can attack us. Save yourself all kinds of mess. Marshmallows, these are just Western family. Whatever brand you prefer. Well, you get to choose. Fine. Like if you'll notice the fire, there's lots of beautiful golden embers. Those are those are, those are prime marshmallow roasting embers. Nice and hot, but they're not going to burn the marshmallow. I noticed you put the marshmallow on both. Can you talk actually a little bit? I yeah, I, that's a, I'm, I'm glad you brought that up. Actually, good question. Um, you see. <laughs> Having it having it lengthwise on both prongs gives you the most control. I've noticed a lot of people, a lot of people like putting one marshmallow onto one prong, and as the marshmallow softens from the heat and starts to melt, it'll it'll you'll lose control. You'll start spinning it, and it'll just like the rod will spin inside the marshmallow. Whereas this will just you know this will give you the maximum control. What about using like a what, how do you feel about natural tools such as a sharpened stick or a like a well, that's a splintered gotcha. bone of an animal? Those are those are really place? ideal. Whoa, like, those, those are perfect if you can find them. All right, so that's that's a good amount of done, I'd say. <laughs> My English goes out the door once I'm like, no, I'm being filmed or something like that. I get so nervous or something. Oh, it's gonna fall. Yes, sir. He's got a gun. I'll play with the gun, guys. Oh, yeah. Can't. There we go. Oh, yeah, because they got. That is the perfect s'more now. Well, this is actually for Eric. So, so why don't we switch? <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I, yeah, I don't need s'mores. <laughs> are you kidding? I'm gonna put that still uh, Are you kidding? Mind. I don't need that crap. Mmm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there we go.